Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome to my channel. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And if you guys are new to this channel, then be sure to like and subscribe and notification on so you guys can get notified for our new video. And let's start today's video without any further ado. And in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how you guys can fix your unable to connect or please try again letter or solve in WhatsApp. So, so basically when this problem arises, the main reason behind why this problem arises is because your whatsapp is not able to connect with your network so the main reason behind this could be if your internet connection is slow so if your internet connection is slow so whatsapp can't run properly so make sure if your internet connection is stable and if you still have this problem even though your internet connection is stable then the other thing you can do is go to your play store and check if your whatsapp is up to date play store or app store depends on the phone which you are using if it's an iphone then it's going to be app store and if it is an android then it's going to be play store just Go to the place where you download your WhatsApp and check if there is an update or not. So my WhatsApp is up to date since there is no update button over here and there's an open button. But if there's an update button over here instead of open, make sure to update your WhatsApp because it could be caused by some bugs and updating WhatsApp could solve it. So since the main reason behind this problem could be of the internet, then the other thing you can do is turn on airplane mode. Just turn your airplane mode on for like 3 minutes and after 3 minutes, close your airplane mode and turn on your Wi-Fi and then try to connect to your whatsapp again and it should fix it and if it still doesn't fix it the other thing you can do is hold on the whatsapp icon and click on app info and after you click on app info it's gonna take you to this page and on this page click on storage usage so this is whatsapp setting like phones whatsapp setting then click on clear catch and after clearing the catch go back click on permission make sure all these permission is turned on over here and after turning all these permission on make sure to restart your phone and after restarting your phone connect your wi-fi and then try to you know log into your whatsapp again it should fix your problem if it still doesn't fix your problem then the last option is go to app info again and on app info click on data usage status and click on network permission make sure wi-fi and mobile data is selected over here from your setting if your Wi-Fi and mobile data is given separately, then make sure to tick both of them. But if it is given at one place like this, then just tick mark it. And after tick marking it, go back, close your WhatsApp. And after closing your WhatsApp, open it again and it should fix your problem. So that's basically it. So if you guys found this video helpful, then be sure to like and subscribe with notification on. And comment down below what type of video we should make next. And if you guys have any question related with this video, feel free to comment down below. We'll help you solve that problem by answering your question. And I'm signing out. Have a nice day, everybody. Bye-bye and peace out.